Awesome. Well, welcome everybody. This is our six figures in six months training. I'm literally going to give you the the framework, the seven steps in this framework. And I'm going to walk you through it step by step. And at the very end, I'm going to tie it all together for you. And you're literally going to see how this is possible. Okay. So I want to share my screen and we are going to dive right in. And at the very end, you guys, I will be opening up for questions. Okay. I will not be opening up for questions now. We'll wait till the very end. And of course my computer's going slow. Okay. So six figures in six months. This is a live training. We'll be doing this on Tuesday and Thursday. So if you want to attend both, you are more than welcome to. So I want to share with you guys my journey. Okay. I was new to digital marketing. And when I discovered this, right, and followed the system. I, I was brand new. So I'm only sharing that with you because you don't have to be no guru. You don't have to have no brand. You don't have to have no following, right? All you have <laughs> to have is a worth ethic and be willing to be coachable and be willing to be consistent and be willing to plug in. I can promise you, if you can do those four things, you can move mountains in your life. Anything is possible. So I want to share with you because, and this also has to do with you have to be patient as well. And we live in such a microwave society. It's hard to be patient, right? We want, we want that immediate gratification quickly. So I just want to share with you how my journey with my first six months, what my income did. Okay. So um, I started September 10th, right? And I started this going after six figures in six months. And actually I didn't start doing that when I started. Um, I will share with you the month I decided, I was like, oh my gosh, I can hit six figures, but I'm just going to show this journey with you. October was 14,000. November was 22. When I hit November, I was like, oh my gosh, I think I can hit, I think I can go for six figures. Right. And I, I started tracking and the moment I started tracking, everything changed. So you see what I did in December and in January and in February. And you guys, I ended up making 152,000 in six months. So um, almost double the six figures, right? So if you probably did the math, I think I hit it five months in a, in a handful of days, right? But six figures in six months, I think is a really great goal that anybody can achieve. So I'm gonna break it down for you today. You're literally gonna get off of here and know exactly what you need to do. So step one is the power of promoting what people want. You guys, I can give you this framework and you can get really excited today, but if you're not promoting a product or service that's in high demand, it's not going to work. Like I can give you this blueprint today and then I can tell you I'm selling a cassette tape and you know it's not going to work. There is no way, there's not, there's no way I can make six figures in six months selling a cassette tape because nobody wants that anymore. So one of the most important things you can do is identify high demand products and services, okay? Second thing is do market research. The third thing is Google Trend. That can be your very best friend. You can see what's really, really trending. Next, keyword search. Google Keyword Planner, there's Uber Suggest, there's SEM Rush. Those will tell you what people are looking for. Okay. So when I did it, this is what I discovered it was. <laughs> this is what people are wanting. This is one of the fastest growing trending industries. Okay. So let me go back to that. And, and that literally, you guys, is um the information business, the e-learning industry, and write that down, e-learning industry is the fastest growing industry out there. You guys, it does a billion a day. The information business is not going anywhere. Matter of fact, it's projected now to hit a trillion dollar year industry by 2027. So yes, there is a lot of money to be made in the e-learning industry. So that is what I would recommend. Finding e-learning products, finding products, digital products. People are going digital now. So that is what I chose to promote. And I'm going to share with you why I decided to go with these products, but let's get, keep on going on. Okay. So we're going to go to step two. So remember step one, you have to promote something in high demand. So write that down, something in high demand. Step two, you have to know who your ideal customer is. Okay. So this is, and I target marketing. So if you try to do like vanilla marketing or generic marketing, that's like throwing mud at the wall and seeing what sticks. Now, depending on your age, you'll get this. So back before social media days, it was a lot of advertising. And it was literally the method, throw the mud at the wall, seeing what sticks. 
and go after what sticks. Um, and some people have think that's the exact same way in today's world. It's not. So let's think of Baskin and Robbins for a moment. It's ice cream, okay? They are not successful because of vanilla. They're successful because they do flavors and they will take a flavor of the month. Dairy Queen does the exact same thing. They're brilliant with it, right? They take this flavor of the month and they know who their target audience is for that flavor. And that's what they promote. That's why they get customers, right? So you have to know who your target market is. When you are have a con, um, customer centric approach to your content, you will win every time. You will stand out every time. Again, just generic doesn't work. Okay. And I'm going to show you how to be customer centric with your approach. You're going to learn that today. Um, you have a competitive edge, right? There's so many people out there. I would say probably 85% of people out there are marketing the wrong way, even the ones spending money. And they just keep on spending more money and more money and they're not getting better results. Today, you guys are going to learn how you don't have to spend any money and how you can attract your perfect customers to you. Okay. I'm going to, I'm going to give you that little competitive edge and show you the importance of this. Okay. Um, it improves your communication. When you know who your perfect customer is, it's no different than you and I going for a walk. We're going down the street right now and we're going for a walk. And you and I've been friends forever. I know how to communicate with you. There wouldn't be that awkwardness. See, when you know how to improve the communication with your perfect customer, because you know who they are, you'll literally feel like you guys are just going for a walk or you're just sitting at a coffee shop. And when they can, when you can get somebody, okay, that's on social media and they can lean in and they're watching your content, they're like, wow. Where's this person been my life? That is how you attract your perfect customers to you. And you're going to learn that, okay? So building relationships. Remember this, and I would write this down. People do business with people they know, like, and trust, okay? People do business with real people. People do business with people they know, like, and trust. So if you know who your ideal customer is, you'll know how to communicate with them. Um, one thing else I love about it is when you know who your perfect customer is, they give you feedback. And then you can be more innovative, right? What did I say at the very beginning of this? Thursdays is probably going to be a little bit different because I'm going to get your guys' feedback today. And then I'm going to know how to improve it. So when you are creating content for your perfect customer and they're continuing to give you feedback, you can continue to just to be very innovative and give them what they need. So here's the journey you need to take your perfect customer on, okay? And I'm going to help you find your perfect customer real quick here. And so... Everybody starts with a problem, right? There's some pain point that they have that they want to have solved. So they're happy. Like you guys are hanging out with me right now because you like, I want to make six figures. I want to know how to do that working two hours a day. I don't want to grind anymore because you know, if you can figure that out, you will be happy and you will live a different life. So write this down. You guys don't make a sad face and a happy face and make these six little marks because these six marks is going to help you create the right content to attract your perfect customers to you. And let me share something with you guys. This is where it gets fun. This is where it gets fun. Here's what I mean by that. Because you actually love creating content because you know you're 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 getting your message out there that can make a difference in somebody's life, okay? And you're never on that struggle bus of, I don't know what to say. I don't really feel like creating content. You won't have that because you're just taking your perfect customers on a journey from, here's their problem. I have a solution and I'm going to help them see that I have a solution. So let's define your perfect customer, okay? Well, describe them. So what is their age? What is their gender, their income, their employment status? Write as much information about them as you can. You guys, this is so important. So for example, I'm just giving an example on my content that I create. I would never have a 25-year-old single guy just out of college ever on my content. He would crack up at me, right? He wouldn't even, I wouldn't even stop his scroll. 
Okay. So I share that with you because when you are so defined who your perfect customer is, they will never find your content, the ones that aren't your perfect customer. And so that's why for one reason in business, when you know who your perfect customer is, there is zero saturation because you repel the ones that aren't a fit for you and you attract the ones that are, you actually start becoming like a magnet. Okay. And so this is why this is so important to take some time and describe them. Okay. Now describe their needs based on the information that you gathered about your perfect customer. What are their needs? What do they really need? Like what, what is that they need? Okay. The next is describe their current challenges. What problems or issues related to their business? Okay, so what do they need? Like, this is where you come, like, they're a desperate buyer. You guys, a year ago, I was desperate. I needed a change. I was ready, right? And um, I discovered my business that I'm doing now. I discovered it from a picture post. But she knew my problems because she was really good at actually defining who her perfect customer was. And she had the right words on the screen that stopped my scroll, gave me goosebumps, got me excited, and I was ready, right? You guys, I've never even talked to her. I've never had questions for her. She was so good with that perfect message. When you get there, this is what happens because there is buyers out there ready to buy from you, okay? So describe their vision. What do they really, really want? You guys, this is probably one of the most important things you can do. Because if you don't really know what they want, how can you get a message out there solving their problem? So describe their vision. Take some time with this, you guys. What do they really, really want? You guys, I spent so much time on those questions I just shared with you that I could visually see my perfect customers. I was sitting in a chair and they're sitting on the couch. And so every time I go to create a piece of content, I visually just see them. To a point that I can, I can feel them. Like I can feel what's going to happen when I, when I share with them and I can help them see that I have their solution, that there is a solution. They don't have to stay stuck, right? This is so important. The vision of your perfect customer. Okay. Yeah. You have to have your vision as well. And we're going to cover that. But the vision of your perfect customer is so important. Okay. So step three. Sales funnel and email automations. Now, many of you right now probably just went, oh, I thought there was no tech. There isn't, okay? There isn't. So don't worry about tech. Let's just worry about why a sales funnel and email automations are so important, okay? And so you guys, it's an effective, okay, you need to use an effective sales funnel, not just any sales funnel. You need to make sure that it's proven to convert because here's what happens. If you try to just recreate the will or you go off of your emotions and you create a sales funnel, then you have to add more time to the six figures in six months because then you have to add the testing phase. That's so important. And you're going to learn that today, right? There's a testing phase. When you create a funnel from scratch, you got the message, the colors, the pictures, everything, you have to test it all. So you have to add that and then once your funnel is created and it's tested, then you can do your six figures in six months, okay? I'm going to show you how to get a pre-built done for you funnel today so you don't have to worry about the testing, okay? And I'm going to show you, I'm going to prove to you, documentation meets conversation. I'm going to prove to you how well it works. But you need to use an effective sales funnel, you guys, and automate your email. You need to have marketing campaigns that convert. I will share with you, when you have an effective sales funnel and you have automations that convert and work, Call it your freedom machine because it will always be out there working for you 24-7, for you. You guys, when I was able to wrap my head around a sales funnel, the light bulb came off and I'm like, oh, I get it. So this is how I can work two hours a day. And I'm going to break down the two-hour workday with you. This is how I can work two hours a day, but have that automated business out there. The automations are out there working for me. You guys, it takes people on a journey, the journey of the know, like, and trust. Man, I just want people to know what we have. I want people to see if they're going to like it and see if they can trust. It's a solution for what they're looking for. So guess what? Why I'm doing the things that I love, spending time with my family, traveling, doing fun things. My automated business is out there working for me 
four, seven. That's what you need. If not, you're going to be trading time for dollars. Now, guess what? I'm going to add another layer to this sales funnel that you're going to absolutely love. And that is, this gives you, are you ready? A rejection free business. So no more grabbing a notebook and no more taking notes of who do I need to follow up with? What do I need to say to them? When did I do this? Or, oh, I need to check my DMs because I need to follow up with 59 million people. You never have to. When you have a fully automated business, it does all of the follow-up and the follow-through for you. You guys, this is what gives you your life back, okay? You're gonna, I'm gonna tie it all together, but I just want you to understand the power of having a sales funnel and the email automations because it literally is everything. Again, it's going to nurture your potential customers and build trust with them. Like right now, while you and I are hanging out, there's so many people going through my automations. Matter of fact, funny story, right? When I'm, I'm, this is what, this is, what, this is a step you just can't make up, right? So I'm hanging out with you guys right now. And I'm literally talking about automations, right? Literally talking to you about automations. And I just made $600. That's what I'm talking to you guys about. Fully automated. I didn't have to do anything for that. I get to do what I love, which is help you guys. My automations did that, right? You see that? My automations did that. It's right there. You can see. Between my fantasy football, I won again, by the way. Side, sorry, can't get me going on football. <laughs> anyway, that's what I'm talking about with automations. There, it's always out there working for you 24-7. You want to automate your business. And I'm going to show you how to do that, Okay. And without you, and you don't, you do not have to be tech savvy to have an automated business. Okay, so let's, let's keep on going. But how crazy is that? I'm talking about automations and boom. So what are, what is a sales funnel? So it's three pages. You'll have your squeeze page, which is that's where you collect the email. And then you have a thank you page. You deliver what you told them you were going to deliver is on the thank you page. And then a video page will be the first video they receive in the emails, okay? That will give them more information that they're looking for. Both at the thank you page and the video page will drive them back to your website so somebody can buy from you, okay? So here's mine. Here's the one I love. Here's the one I recommend because it works and it's been working really, really well for the last year not only for me, but for my community. And it's this right here, you guys, and it has a 50% conversion. So why is that important? Because when I know that number, that means, you guys, I need 40 people a day to land on this page, and I know 20 are going to subscribe. So when I'm mentoring my community, I know what their numbers should be. So if their numbers aren't there yet, we know how we need to fix them. Because documentation meets conversation. Numbers don't lie. There's no emotion in numbers. You can't make money if you're living in your emotions. But you can make money knowing your numbers. Okay? Hugely important. And so this is what it looks like. There's my the, the squeeze page where people put their email in. Then they're immediately taken to the thank you page and the video page. Okay. 50% conversion. You can see it right here in my funnel. Now watch this. Here is what happens if they do not buy from you. Our funnel converts about one out of 20. That's why I'm like, your goal is always to get 40 people a day through your automated system, not you personally finding 40, but your automated system. And I will show you how we do that. That's gonna be coming up here. So what happens if they don't buy? We take them on a journey. It's the journey of the no like, and trust, right? We just want people to know what we have, see if they're gonna like it, the automations take over. So why use automations? Well, automations right now, there's 4.3 billion users of automations is projected to hit 4.6 billion by 2025. So email isn't going anywhere, okay? So here's something else. I want you to think about this. And I, this is what I'd recommend you writing down. Email equals income. Email will give you, building an email list will give you a predictable income stream, okay? So the industry, the marketing industry average is $1 you should make on average per, per each person on your email list, 
So each subscriber, you should make about a dollar. That is a good industry average. So if you have um, 10,000 email lists, you should be making about 10,000 a month. That's on the average, the, the email subscribers average, okay? So here's what I recommend in our community. And this is what I recommend you guys do is you have an email go out every day for two weeks. Then after that, you have a once a week newsletter go out. Then this will develop again that no like and trust. But then also there's other little promotions and things that you can do to send other emails out. But this is what I recommend. This is what has made me a lot of money and is always out there working for me. That formula works. So make sure you screenshot that so you have that. So you're making sure to use that, okay? Now, the average email open rate for all industries is 21%, okay? So I will share with you the um, automations that you're going to get access to today. Literally, you guys, this is my open rate, 66 Actually, I should have um, screenshotted a new one because this actually went up to 68. But my point is, as you can see, it's all of them are well above the average of 21%. I train you how to get your open rate up to there. There's many cool things that you can do to get it there, okay? So with the average open rate of 21%, but what is the click rate? The click rate is the offer inside of it. What is the percent of clicking? The average is 2.6. As you can see, ours is well above 2.6. So again, we will show you how to have a winning funnel and a winning automations. Because I will tell you what, if you do not have a winning funnel, you will not make six figures in six months working two hours a day. Okay, you, you just won't. You have to get that numbers there. This is about um, not working harder. It's about working more effective. It's so important. So let me just give you an example, okay, of this system. So as you can see, this was my numbers. I have 7,071 leads. This was from, you can see it goes over here past October. When I started using this system, right, until, I can't remember the date. I have it on here. So it's through July 31st. Okay, so I'm just sharing that with you because in July, Okay, I made $51,000 in July. That was on my Stripe, not including my PayPal, but we're just going to do easy math and just do Stripe, okay? So I want you to look at my numbers, you guys. My email list is worth $7.23 $7 per person on my email list. So imagine if you knew you had 7,000 people on your email list and you're going to make 49000 now, if we go off of the, the email industry averages, I should be making about 7,000 a month because it's a dollar. Why am I telling you guys all of this? Because these numbers are huge and this is what you want to learn to do. You want to learn how to have numbers like this so you can get the results like this. Yes, everybody can be like, oh, I have a sales funnel. I have email automations. That's good. I'm glad you do, but what does it convert at? Ask people how it's converting. If you have somebody that is mentoring you, that's what you should ask them. Great. I'm glad you're making money, but what are your numbers? Because that's what I want to look at because I don't want to work really, really hard to make my money. I want to work smarter. And that's what I'm sharing with you guys today. The secret sauce is in these, this framework that I'm giving you. But it's also, you have to have a winning funnel. You have to have a winning system or there's no way things can be done in two hours a day. It's so important um, with that. It's no different than anything, right? You see really good football teams and they have really good coaches. You can change the coach and that team can get even better or can get worse. So make sure no matter what you do, the journey needs to be with a mentor that can actually show you results like this and help you get these type of results, okay? So step four, leveraging social media um, for the buyer attraction, right? For your perfect customer, okay? So <laughs> there's over 4 billion people that use social media worldwide. So it is one of the best business tools that you can use to reach and engage with your perfect customer customer. But also, you guys, it's your time freedom. Because people might think you're on social media all the time because they're seeing your videos all the time. Because I post first thing in the morning and then I'm typically done posting my videos. First thing in the morning, I love just doing the morning. Then I have all afternoon to do the things that I love. Again, I'm going to show you how to build time freedom. Okay. So let's talk about social media and leveraging. So you want to build a strong online presence. 
you with your, and you get to decide what social media platform is best for you. Okay. There's, you can use TikTok, you can use Facebook, you can use Instagram, you can use YouTube, you can use several of them. You can use one of them. Um, there's many, many that you can use. You got to decide, but when you decide you got to go all in with that platform and you have to stay consistent. That's the thing. You can't be Lucy Lou, right? And go like, mm, I think today I'll do Instagram. Oh, I think tomorrow I'll do YouTube or, you know, I think Facebook. And, mm, I don't know. I mean, I haven't done TikTok for a few days. I might do it. That will never make you money. So I personally started with one platform because I just wanted to get really, really, really good with my message and my presence on that platform. So I really recommend one or two and you just staying in that lane until you start making really good money on that platform. Okay. Now you need to create engaging and valuable content. This is don't, you can't, no vanilla marketing. You need to create content that people want to engage in something that will bring value that people are like, wow, I didn't know that. Or really? Oh man, that's, that's good information. Or Oh, wow. Dang, I can really relate to them. Or oh, man, where's this person been my whole life? When you can get people to say that about your content, you're doing the right thing. Okay. So attracting your target audience on social media platforms, you guys, this is why we talked about knowing who your perfect customer is. I just create content that will stop their scroll. This is one of the most important things you can do. It's not about creating content to create content. It's not about going, okay, I've decided I'm going to do Instagram and Facebook. I just got to create three videos a day. Let's go. It's not like that whatsoever. It's like, okay, I want to use Facebook and Instagram to build my business. I'm going to create three pieces of content today. So Instagram is more people kind of want to be um, coddled and kind of snuggled on Facebook on Instagram. Facebook is like, oh, did you hear about that? Facebook is more the drama and they, people want to know what's going on. So you have to create content to fit the social media platforms. Sometimes videos work on both. They do. Now, if, if sometimes you can put a video on, on TikTok and then you can put it on Instagram and it does nothing or vice versa, right? Your customers on those platforms will tell you. So make sure you take the time to really, when you decide what platform you want to use, you understand how your audience communicates over there. So what I would do is I would spend some time going to maybe some, um, some people that are your um, competitors and I don't want you to watch their content because then you'll judge yourself. I want you to look at the comments in the content. I don't want you looking at their videos because then you're going to be like, ah, oh, if I was as good as them, I would do as good as them. Stop it. You are enough. You are good enough. You looking at other people's stuff is what stops you from being you and being real. Fun fact, I do not look at anybody's stuff. I do not. I will literally, when I'm creating a video and it's, and it scrolls, you know, like it's uploading, I will watch the content that shows up and it's typically somebody in my community. I will watch that and I will love on them, but that's it. Then I'm back to creating my next video or I'm done. I do not spend the time watching. I did. I made a mistake at the very beginning and I found some really good gurus. And I literally was like, oh man, I just want to be like them. And I was like trying to watch their stuff. And then I looked at my videos. I'm like, oh, that's not even you. What are you doing? Do you, do you, they do them. I'm going to do me. And that's when I quit. That, that was the, the week that I was like, man, you're making this way too hard. But I do like looking at the comments because if they have your audience, okay, and they're your competitors and they have your audience, your, your customers will tell you what they want. You could probably get six months of content ideas by looking at the comments. Don't worry about the video. Don't worry about what the video says. Just look at the comments. Your customers will tell you. And this is how you can create audience that your perfect customers want to, or create content that your perfect customers want to see. So I do recommend doing that. I don't recommend watching and comparing. Because when you know who your perfect customer is, you can be messy 
You can be messy. You can have a poor quality video, poor quality sound, and they will love you because you get them. It's not about you. It's about them. And when they realize that you understand them, they'll want to do business with you. No matter how your hair looks, no matter how your background looks, right? No matter what you have on, it don't matter. What matters is that you understand them. Okay, so step five, implementing a CTA in your content. So what is a CTA? It's a call to action. This is giving them something to do. It's giving them the next step. You guys, we have been programmed since a kid to be told what to do. When we go to school, you go to the bathroom at a certain time, you have a recess at a certain time, PE, lunch, you come home, you probably have dinner around the same time. You have such a pattern of being told what to do that if you're just creating content, somebody could watch one of your videos and be like, oh man, this is really good. It's really good. But you didn't tell them what to do next. So they're like, wow, that's really good. Then they keep on scrolling. But if they, if you create that same video and it's really good, they're like, man, this is really good. And you're like, um, put more info in comments if you want to learn more. They're like, okay, yeah, I do want to learn more. And they'll go type in more info. So when, when you deliver value to your perfect customer, they will want to learn more from you. Not only do CTAs, you guys, this is so important. Not only do CTAs help you find your perfect customers, CTAs will help you grow your following of your perfect customer. But CTAs will also tell you if you're delivering a good enough content. Now, there's many gurus out there that don't agree with what I just said to you, okay? They will be like, no, no, don't do a CTA in every video because if you do a CTA in every video, people will feel like they're being sold. <laughs> well, you guys, only in a perfect world are you even gonna get half of the people to make it to the very end. Go, go, every social media platform has the analytics in it. Go look at your analytics. You will see how many people make it to the very end of your content. Not a lot. So the ones that do really like you. Make sure you tell them the next step. I literally always do a CTA. Maybe two out of 30 videos I don't. Or if I'm responding to obviously a question, right? Because on TikTok, you guys, if somebody asks you a question, you can actually reply back with the video. Then I never do CTA in them. But on my content, literally maybe two out of 30, I do not do a CTA. Because what if... What if the day you don't do a CTA is the day two people really just loved your video and they make it to the very end? And this is really good. But you didn't tell them what to do next, so they just keep on scrolling. Doesn't just do a CTA. It is, it has helped me build a very, very successful business. And it will help you as well. When you do a CTA the correct way, and that's what we're going to learn today, okay? I'm going to show you how to do a CTA the very correct way. So not only will it build your email list because you're giving somebody an action step and the action step is to take them back to your automated system, okay? You're building your following and you're seeing how good your content is because if you get a lot of people and engaged in that, you know you need to create more of that, okay? So in a CTA, you gotta be very clear what you want them to do. So for example, you guys, I will deliver value or share something, share my story, share something. And at the very end, I'll be like, if you want to learn more, put yes in the comment. I would absolutely love to share it with you. So at the very end, I will say that, okay? I have tested. I have said the link is in the bio. Here's why that doesn't work as well. Most people will discover you on when they're, when they're scrolling. You create friction when you tell them the link is in the bio. Because you're making them get off their pattern of scrolling. And most people won't because they, they're scrolling. But you think about it. If you do a CTA and you tell them to put yes in the comments or more info, they can do that while they're scrolling. They can just go in real quick, type it in, and keep on scrolling. If you're taking them off of their For You page or their news feed, then you're going to lose a lot of people. I've tested it and I've tested it. And so always do a call to action where you tell them to do a comment. Plus, if you're telling them to go to the link in your bio, 
you're not allowing the social media platforms, social media algorithms to help you find more of your perfect customer. Plus, you don't know how well the video worked because you don't know if anybody went to the link or not. I track it. And then I track like the videos got really good engagement and good comments. And then I will repurpose those videos again. Like on days I don't have time to do my three videos. I will be able to just use repurpose videos. Okay. Choose strong action words. Ready. Yes. Let's go. More info. Right? Change. Words that empower people to take action. Okay. Yes. I like if you, you know, if you want to learn more, but yes, in comment, I'd absolutely love to share with you. I mean, people like, yeah, like you want to get them fired up to take that next step. Okay. And you've got to create a sense of value. That is so important, right? It's like, and I will be, listen, if you want to learn step-by-step step the blueprint that I follow to learn the skills to make daily pay, but yes, in the comments, I'd absolutely love to share with you. See the value. Yeah. Who wouldn't want to learn that? Right. So if they make it to the end, you guys, they are a really good, perfect potential customer. Okay, next step is step six is the two hour work day. I'm gonna give you the framework. This is where a lot of people can't wrap their head around that you can actually do this in working two hours a day. Okay, what the two hours is, you guys, is priority focus time. There's no interruptions during this time. It can be done in two solid hours. It can be done in 30 minutes, in 30 minute time slots and hour time slots. But there's zero interruptions. Nobody can bother you. You can't check emails. You can't do, well, you can't check emails that is not for business, right? I'll go over it with you. But it's literally priority focus time. It's not busy time. It's not two hours of thinking you're working, okay? Um, it's activities that drive to results. Activities that drive to results. I can promise you guys, if you get really, really, really good following a two-hour workflow and you follow this framework, you're going to create habits that will create a CEO mindset, mindset that will create a CEO income. But too many of you think it's just being busy to be busy. I can promise you one thing. Your current circumstances is why your income is where it is. To change your income, you got to change your skill set. You got to raise your standards. And being you can start doing that with a two-hour workflow. And I'm going to give you mine here in a minute. But these are non-negotiables. Like these are, you will set your two-hour day and you will get it done. Yep, at first you're not going to. At first, because you're, you, you were dabbling or you were overthinking and you're not going to get it done in two hours. But that doesn't mean you look at your clock and be like, oh, well, it's been two hours and 12 minutes. Like I can't finish. No, because these are non-negotiables. What you got to do is you got to get better with your time. You got to figure out why, why at two hours and 12 minutes didn't I get this done? How can I get better with my time? I'm going to set you up for success. I'm not going to set you up to grind and lose time with your family. I'm setting you up for success, okay? It's not about what you work on. It's about what you complete. This is huge. I love this. This, this was, you know, I, I have six kids, you guys. This was my saying from the moment I had kids, structure equals freedom. I had so much structure in my house that gave me so much freedom. People would come to my house like, how is your house so organized? And your, your kids are, rooms are clean and everything's da 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 And I'm like, structure equals freedom. I only have two kids and my house is a mess. My mm, structure equals freedom. And I've just, I've, I've taken that same mindset into my business. So just remember that structure equals freedom. It's not about what you work on. It's about what you complete. Okay. So let's talk about that. Okay. I'm going to give you my, my work day to earn daily pay. So I do three pieces of content. You guys, it takes me about 45 minutes, about 15 minutes per each piece, sometimes less. Sometimes, like sometimes one piece might take 10 minutes, one might take 18 minutes, but it averages about 15 minutes per piece. So three pieces of content, 45 minutes. Okay. I go live. You guys, 30 to 45 minutes when I started, I when I started going live. But before I would go live, my first three months, I never went live. I never went live in September. I never went live in October. And I never went live in November. I went live a handful of times in November. I wasn't mentally there to go live yet. So I did the copy and paste method for 30 minutes a day, okay? I would respond to CTAs 
and reply to emails of people that were interested. That would take about 15 minutes. And then I would spend 15 minutes in the community learning and engaging. You guys, that literally is a two hour work process. So these are income earning activities. These are the only things that will drive results to your business. These are the things that you want to perfect. These are the things that you want to get really, really good at. After you get these things done, it don't matter what you do after that. You can learn more. You can engage in other things more, but this is what, this is your non-negotiables that need to be done. And again, you can chop it out. Now I will share with you when I first started creating content on social media, I had to mentally get ready to create the videos. So what I did when I first started, you guys, I actually created all my content in one day. I would go grab seven shirts out of my closet and I literally would create 21 videos. I already had my topics wrote down and I would literally create three videos, change my shirt, three videos, change my shirt. And I just saved them all in my drafts. And I would do all 21 videos. It would take me about two hours to create all 21 videos because you had momentum going and it was just so much quicker. I don't have to do that anymore because now I could just whip them in a day, but it, it, it works because that two hours was just to create them, right? It wasn't to edit them and post them, right? And so now I can just do 45 minutes a day. That includes create, edit, post, and let's go, right? And so that helped me at the very beginning. That's something that you might need to do. Now, if you're listening to me right now and you don't want to do videos, then don't do videos. Start with picture posts. Start with faceless videos. If you do them the right way, you can attract your perfect customers. And inside the community, I'm going to be taking a deeper dive and really helping you guys with that, okay? So this was literally, I hope you guys screenshotted it or wrote it down because this is what will drive results to your business is knowing these activities. So step six, seven is cultivating the right mindset and community. Oh my goodness, you guys, this is everything right here because distractions will come in many forms when you're trying to change something new. It's going to come in people um, from, you know, pleasure to pain, <laughs> right? It's going to come from, you know, your favorite TV shows, from scrolling on social media, from family, right? It's, you're just going to get so many different distractions. So having the right mindset and being part of the right environment is everything, okay? So the environment that you are in right now has got you to where you are. You're not going to grow more staying in the same environment. To level up, you have to level up who you hang around with. Have you guys ever heard that saying, you are the five people you hang around with the most? So imagine if you could get inside of a community full of people making four, five, and six figures, people that are engaging every day, that are working on their goals of making six figures in six months. Do you think you would learn a little bit more, yes or yes? I want you to look at this example. Let's say you have a child and they come home tonight. He comes home and he's like, I'm going out for basketball this year. You're going to be like, cool, I love it. You're not going to get in the car and take him to tennis courts because then he would learn tennis. What's the first thing that you would do? You'd get him in the car. You'd go buy him a basketball. You'd go hang out at basketball courts. Okay. You'd get him on a team, have him a coach. Do you think if you did those five things that your son would learn more about basketball? Yes or yes. For some odd reason, we think we're different. We think if I invest in something, I should just be able to be in my same stinking thinking, my same environment, my same habits and make six figures. That's, you know, that's not true. If it was, you would already be making six figures. So you have to change your environment. And that is why being part of a thriving community is so important. So important that you can do. You guys, not only do you get your questions answered, not only do you feel part of something, you're heard, you're validated, and you'll be able to start growing in ways you didn't realize the growth that you needed to have. Okay. So that is something that is so important to achieve. So the power of a positive mindset. I will share with you guys 
not every day is rainbows and sunshine. <laughs> you're going to have days where there's going to be distractions or there's going to be, you know, um, you're questioning yourself, right? Or stuff from the past creeps in of feeling of worthiness or failure. And that's going to creep in. So keeping in a positive mindset is so important. So what we do in our community is I actually do a 90 day ramp up, which every day you get a video that gives you an action step to really help you keep that positive CEO mindset. The next is surround yourself with a supportive community. You will absolutely love the community and what you get to be part of. And I can promise you, you guys, when you're part of a supportive community, you're going to find an accountability partner that you guys can bounce ideas off of each other and hold each other accountable to reach your goals and dreams as well. And then the next is um, staying motivated at overcoming challenges. I call this, you got to learn to manage your mind because the, the mindset you have now got you to where you are. You're going to have to raise those standards and learn to manage your mind and manage the things that are going to happen, good and bad. And okay, so now let's do the fun part. Let's do the math. How in the world are you going to make six figures in six months with these seven steps? Okay, let's do the math. Now, based off of my numbers, I promote a product that's $600. Okay, so you're going to have to do the math on this. But if you have a product that you already have, write that number down. Okay. Now, not only do I promote a product for $600, I literally make 100% profit. I recommend you having the same thing, my friend. I'm just telling you right now, because when you do, you can make this. Okay, so 167 cells times 600 is 102,000. So all we need to do between now and what, that would be March something, is to get you 167 cells. <laughs> Very doable, right? When you have the right framework to follow. Okay, so this will start literally um, because I'm doing another one of these live trainings on, on Thursday. So I want to start helping you become accountable on September 22nd, and it will go through March 22nd, which is literally the six months, right? So that's 182 days. So the first two weeks, we work on setting up, which will take not even two days, but then you got to work, um, work on discovering who your perfect customer is and creating content. I want to get a flow going the first two weeks. So after that, we will start working on our goal is two weeks to really get a flow going. And after two weeks to have like 20 on average, 20 people a day into your automations that subscribe to your automations because with the system we have 20 a day equals a $600 a day at a $600 a day you're literally going to make 102,000 by March 22nd this does not include the momentum that hits from your email list okay that's just the icing on the cake because yes there'll be days you'll have eight people join your automations there'll be days you'll have 18 there's going to be days you're going to have 40 right on average, we want 20, but what will happen for the days that you don't always have 20, your, your automations are going to start kicking in and, and they literally will start kicking in usually about 90 days. You will start seeing the results of your automations. This is why I tell people do not track until you have 100 people inside your automations. You guys, numbers don't lie. You just... You can't expect to have something and just start creating content and think it's going to work. You cross your fingers. If you know your numbers every day, what needs to be achieved and the time frame it needs to be achieved, it can happen, right? You just got to have that accountability, you know, and you just got to have that right mentorship to make it happen. Okay. So how can you make $600 a day? Well, I recommend you purchasing our premium digital product. When you purchase this, you guys are immediately going to get four different income streams. Okay, not one, not two, not three, but four. You'll be able to promote all four of our in high demand digital products, $50, 150, 300, 600. And you're going to get the resale rights on all four of them, which means you're going to make 100% profit. This is what I would recommend. If you do not want to promote this, that's 100% okay. Just go back to step one and you do, you take the time to do your market research and you take your time to, you know, go to, Uber suggest and Google trends and SM, SEM rush, and you find something that's trending because you've got to promote a product in high demand. You guys, that can take you days or weeks to figure that out. 
or you can have a done for you business ready to go um, today. Because the moment you purchase, you literally, and you pay your website fee, um, you literally get the resale rights. The moment, okay, you do that. So these are the these are the four that we promote. This is our community. You get access to our community, our live mentoring, and I'm going to talk to you guys about that, okay? So when you buy your premium product, we are going to waive your $59 website fee. Why are we going to do that? Because you paid $99 to be part of this training, and so we are going to give you $59 of that back to pay for your website fee. How cool is that? <laughs> How cool? Cool is that. So all you got to do is just get back with the person that introduced you to this and they are going to um, give you the link that they can or you can buy the premium product from them and they will send you the money to waive your $59 fee. Okay. Then you're also going to be immediate access to our thriving community. Okay. Then you also are going to get six months of our digital growth monthly. So what is that? Well, let me just show share that show oops I didn't mean to do that let me just show that to you okay so here is what our community looks like but when you get inside we have the digital growth monthly that you're going to get six months access to it literally gives you every single thing you need we have a monthly meetup where you every month you can get on and you can network with other people. This is going to help grow your following. You're going to learn what's working really well for people. You're going to be equipped with every single thing you need to have a CEO mindset, okay? You're going to have the five stages of business growth, right? You are literally going to um, how to build a compelling brand. So it's going to shave off your learning curve when it goes to marketing. And you are literally also going to have... Um, how to get your business discovered. I literally break down with you each single platform as well, right? How to get your, how to find your perfect customer. You're going to get that. You're going to get finding your ideal customer guide. Um, discover what you can do to stand out. You guys literally, you can see, get everything you need. Plus you're going to get a content toolbox that literally gives you so much additional stuff for free. So you're going to get that for six months. You get access to that for six months. Um, so basically, <laughs> your 99 that you paid to be part of this training, we're going to give 59 of it back for that. Plus the Digital Growth Monthly is a $47 product. Um, so yeah, <laughs> do the math on that. $282, I think it is, that you get value to you for free. Plus also... You probably just looked at the digital growth monthly and you're like, man, I know business owners that could use this. Um, you can you actually have the ability to get a affiliate link on that if you want, and you can promote it as well and get a reoccurring income stream. So not only am I showing you how to make daily pay six figures in six months, but why not an additional reoccurring income stream? So you can get that as well. Now there's going to be live weekly calls to keep you on track and hold you accountable. I'm going to schedule live calls just for the six figures in six months training. So it's probably going to be more of an intimate group because not everybody's going to take me up on it um, and want to follow the six figures in six months. But the ones that do, we will be getting on a call every week where I will be mentoring you through the entire process so we can keep track of your numbers. Okay. And so that is what um, you will get when you purchase. Now, if you do decide, um, I don't think I'm going to purchase, then that's okay. Then just take this information with a business, right? Whatever product or service that you want to promote, but you just got to make sure it's in high demand. You're going to have to create your own funnel and get that testing and stuff done. So what my best recommendation would be is to start the six figures in six months after like 90 days of you getting your, your business and everything together. But if you would love to learn how to promote done for you digital products, learn the exact steps that I did, we're going to take a deeper dive in each of those seven frameworks. Every week, we're going to go into deeper with one where we, um, inside of this six figures in six months, I will be taking people in there that are taking me up on this challenge, and I will be helping you find your perfect customer. I will be helping you unlock that moment of you're like, oh, I know how to create content for my perfect customer. It's going to be very hands-on, and you're going to get 
access to all of those trainings for life as well. So, okay. Thank you guys, everybody for joining us again. If you are ready to purchase your premium product, I want to be the first to welcome you and congratulate you. You're going to absolutely love it. Get back with the person that introduced you here and they can help you get set up with all of that. And then they just need to let me know once you buy so I can give you access to all the other things as well. Okay, so now what I wanna do is just open up for any questions that you guys have, cause that's what I'm here for, for any questions. Um, I went in on the challenge, please. Okay, make sure that you get back with the person that you bought from, and or you, you know, bought your um, six figures in six month blueprint from, and they will get you the link so you can purchase your premium product. And yeah, then you got, you will be getting the, e the information on the trainings that we starting next week. You'll get that inside our community. So yes, very exciting. So anybody have any questions? I do. Yes. Hello. Hi. So are we just essentially reselling what you're selling to us? Are we just reselling to people? You can make six figures in six months. Oh, great question. I actually love that question. So what we promote is, and let me just pull it up for you. So we promote four different digital products, right? So we actually promote digital products and I'm trying to find mine here. Okay. Um, let me just pull it. Let me just show you what they are because there's such a huge difference. So let me just give you a really great example. And Alice, thank you so much for asking that because such a great question. So let's say, for example, um, you were a nurse, right? And you're like, man, I, I want to be a doctor. You're going to have to get this, learn the skills, go back to school to learn the skills to become a doctor, right? And then you get a degree in a doctor. So these are the products that we promote. So if somebody wants to start learning about digital marketing, we have a $50 product where they can start learning the skills about digital marketing. I kind of look at it this way. If you and I were at the lake together and you're like, hey, let's go swim. I'm like, mm let me just dip my toes in the water and see if I want to. That's what this starter product does. So it's $50. And then we have our elite. Our elite product gives you the skills that you need. People are going to learn how to make like three to 600 a month is what you can really make with this, with this product. This is really great for people that just want some extra fun money or some extra cash. So they'll be equipped with what they need to achieve that. Right. OK, so then we have our six figure blueprint. This literally gives you the three hundred dollar a day blueprint. People literally can see step by step what they need to do to achieve three hundred a day, how to have an automated business, how to use all the social media platforms to build that business. And then we have our premium product. This literally, um, I love what Dean calls it. He says, it's a business in a box. And he literally equips you with everything you guys need to literally make a quarter of a million plus a year online. You'll learn everything that you need about digital marketing. Plus, you're, you'll learn how to be a content creator. You will literally learn how to monetize your social media channels, which is money. Um, you'll learn even how to be an affiliate marketer, even how to create your own product. So it literally gives you with everything you need. So here's how I look at it. Like, I'm just going to use the medical field for some reason. I don't know why. You can be an RN. You can be an LPN. You know, you can be a nurse practitioner. You can be a doctor. Which one do you want to learn, right? Then that's what people buy and go to those classes. This is a kind of the way it is from here. You know, what type of digital marketer do you want to be? What kind of skills do you want to learn? And so, yeah, that's what we do. We literally give people, we just promote digital products to help people learn the skills that they're lacking. And I absolutely love it. When I discovered this, you guys, a year ago, that's what I seen. I seen the results people were having from these. And I realized the only reason why I was stuck and not having success is because I didn't have the right skills and knowledge. And this taught me that without me having to know tech. And I thought that was so important. So did that make sense? Yeah. One more question. Sure. So, so suppose everybody on this call now signs up. My question is, how come then I'm not going to have, you know, 240 other competitors next month because everybody else will be trying to sell these same products? Right. Great question. Oh, my gosh. So I literally just did a video over that on TikTok. So let's talk about market saturation, right? Because it is a thing. So I did I did my research on it. Market saturation is when it's 70 percent saturated. 
So right now we have 3,400 people inside our community. And let's just use TikTok as an example. There is 1.6 billion people on TikTok. So with 3,400 people, um, that is 0.00002125% of saturation, not even 1%. To have 1% of saturation is 14 million people. Okay. All right. All right. <laughs> That's our goal. Let's in fact 14 million. We got a bunch of work to do. And, and so my goal is to literally get a thousand people. We, we set a goal in our, in our community to get 10,000 people in our community. At 10,000, you guys, it only changes from um, 0. 0.00020 not even close to 1%, right? And so that is what I love. And now let me add another layer to that though, you guys. And that's the current circumstances right now. In three years, you know how many new people are going to be ready. Like, I hate my job or I want to retire early or I just got laid off or we want to start having a family or I'm drowning in medical debt or I'm drowning in debt or I have college debt. And three years ago, these people weren't even interested, but now they are. That literally opens up us up to a brand new market. That is what I love about the innovation that we have in our group because we're always doing, you know, what's working now, what's innovative and what's working now. And inside the digital growth monthly, you guys, we actually have monthly experts that are going to come on and train us in some type of field that is working really, really, really well in digital marketing. So you guys will always be, be up to the now of, of what's working. Yeah. Did that help? Yep. Thank awesome. you. Any other questions that you have, Alice? Nope. Awesome. Good questions, by the way. All right, so um, anybody else have any other questions? Can I ask you a question? Yes. Yes, uh, let's say uh, you're a truck driver and uh, you're always on the road and how can you make that work for you? Um, how, well, okay, so as far as I know and correct me if I'm wrong, don't truck drivers only have a certain amount of hours that they can actually drive? Right. Okay. So like, what are, what are those hours that you can drive? Let's say uh, 14 hours, well, 11 hours and 14 hours on duty, driving 11 hours a day. Okay. So let you, what was the 14 hours? On duty, you're not driving while you're waiting at a pickup location. Okay, perfect. So let's just do easy math. Let's just do that. We're going to base it on the 14 hours. Okay. So let's say you work 14 hours, you have two hours in there where you kind of, you know, you stop or get food, you know, gas and all that. So that's 16 hours. And then let's say that you sleep nine hours a day. Okay. So we're down to, we still have seven hours left in our day. And let's say you take two hours a day to do the things that you love in life and get ready and cook and all that stuff. That still gives you five hours in your day. All you need is two hours here. Right. Yeah. And as far as training, uh, how do you get, uh, if I purchase, let's say I purchased the product today, how do I get trained to be able to be ready to get my, to get going and start making money? Oh, good question. So the moment you guys purchase, and thank you for asking that because I should have shared that. The moment you purchase, you'll get immediate access to your welcome email and immediate access to our community that will give you your first steps, right? You guys can do all those steps within two hours. And part of that is submitting the information to the company to set up your website for you. So while they're setting up your website, eliminating tech and time for you, while they're doing that, you can be going through our training to learn, you know, how you want to market your business. And we'll be giving you, you know, we give you the action steps and everything to do that. Mm -hmm. And one more question. Since I, uh, I went through you to, to get to this conference and do I get an email form? from you to be able to purchase or how do I do that? Okay, I'm sorry, what was your question again? Okay, you say that get with a the person that invited you uh -huh. and to be able to get the link to purchase the product. Mm -hmm. Since I went directly uh, through you, so will I get, begin the email from you after this call? Yes, I'll email you. Okay, yeah. sounds good, thank you. Uh-huh, and welcome, I can't wait to work with you. It's gonna be good. We have a few other truck drivers in here. So you guys can all kind of bounce ideas off of each other. <laughs> awesome. And I was in the trucking industry for 20 years. So 
I'll always be available if you need help. <laughs> yep, 20 years. That's wild. <laughs> yeah. And look now. Oh, Michelle, can I can I ask something quickly? Sure, absolutely. Um, so if you have a platform already on top in YouTube that you've promoted uh, previously, uh, other products, um, affiliate marketing, um, would you just be, I don't necessarily want to start that. Would you just start a new platform for this or would you be continuing on that platform and just be specific on what you're promoting? And what, what were you promoting before? It was also uh, uh, affiliate marketing uh, um, to join a platform that builds funnels. So it's sort of a little bit, uh, it's clashing a little bit. But No, uh, I think you're great. So just I, can continue and just specify what which one is what. I would. And uh, are you still going to be promoting that uh, the other stuff? I've made money on the other one, so I don't necessarily want to stop it. Um, right. So you could still... what you could do in your link. Um, in your link in your bio, you could do like um, link to, uh, link tree or I, I know people talk about stand store. I don't really know what stand store, but where you can add all your links on it. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you bet. Awesome. Any other questions? That's it. Only two or three questions. <laughs> Awesome. Well, thanks everybody for joining us again. Just get back with the person that introduced you to this. I will be doing another one again. I am going to be hanging on here just a minute and looking through comments because like I said, the questions that I get from you guys that are in here is, um, yeah, thank you. I will show that. Good point. Um, I, cause I just want to make sure whatever I missed in today's, I will be adding it to Thursdays, but yes. So this is a one-time investment of your, of your $600 and then your $59 fee will be waived, right? So there's a one time of your $600 and then there's no monthly expenses, right? And then the, that automated system, we actually give it to you for free. It's already pre-built, ready to go. You just got to plug in your information. I will literally show you how to take that from zero to six figures um, without it costing you a dime. And so there's no monthly expenses and I'll show you how to market. Yeah. So one-time investment. Yes. Yeah. Well, no, because the digital growth monthly is free to them. So, okay. Um, for this first six months. So yeah. And again, you guys, one thing you'll notice, um, one thing every single business has in common is they need customers, right? So you will, um, sell a lot of these blueprints and these digital products just for people that already have an existing business that are struggling getting customers daily because they're just not doing social media. Right. And we can show them how to do it. Right. You're welcome. Thank you guys. Sorry, one, one more question. Um, so as part of this, you know, people that buy the premium product, then are we need to set up, you know, this thing that you set up for us, you know, this um, group for them to join and we have to do the weekly um, nope. calls with them? No, nope. good question, man. Alice, I need to hang out with you because you you fit you're filling in the gaps for me that that where I dropped the ball on. No, so when um when you guys start promoting these digital products, you guys get to be part of our community and your customers do as well. We are a community of people working together. So what's really nice about this is when you guys you guys will be in the learning and earning stages. So when you're learning and earning, you know, people can be in the community. Your customers can be in there getting their questions answered as well. Mike, let me give you a great example. In an hour and 45 minutes, I no 45 minutes, I'm doing a tech Zoom where I'm getting on with the community and I'm answering any tech questions that they have. So Alice, your question or your customers are more than welcome to get on that and get their assistance with their tech as well. So yeah. Okay. All right. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Um, do, 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 do. Uh, I have a question. Yes. Um, so now that we already have like a hundred followers on TikTok, um, can we do we need to allow um like anybody to join us? Or does it only need to be like affiliate, like um, people, like digital products? I mean, you you need to just have your following be your perfect customers. Okay. 
Mm -hmm. uh, just trying to make sure. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, definitely try to find your, your perfect customers. It's better to, you know, have just, less followers and more your perfect customer. Okay. Mm -hmm. Because people come in all the time trying to be like, want to be your friend or you to follow them. But I'm always scared to say yes, because they're right. They're not. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Thank you. Yes. Uh, thank you, Liz, for that comment. That is so sweet. I'm trying to get caught up in comment. Anybody else have a question? Jacqueline says she has a question. Um, Jacqueline Morse, if you want to unmute, I would love to answer your question. Yeah, I have a question, please. Yes, how are you? I'm doing great, thanks. Hey. Nice to meet you online. Yes, I know, nice to meet you. <laughs> yeah, please, I want to do, because really at the moment I don't have a computer. I don't know how to really go about uh, what you just taught us now, how I can do the, the automator. I mean, Jamie, I don't know. The, to pick the automate. The automations? Yeah. Okay. Um, Are you able to jump on the next call coming up here so I can help you with that? Mm. What time will it be because? In 45 minutes. What time is it there? Um, yeah, we have almost 10 p.m. Oh, gosh. You guys, so we are an international business, right? We have people all over the world. That's why I was asking what time it is. Um, yeah, I mean, if you can jump on or just send me an email of what you're you're asking, and then I can even create a video for you and help you with that. Okay, then that'll be great. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Awesome. Thank you so Thank much. You for being on so late. That's so awesome. Yeah. yeah. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Yes. So Angie was asking, um, can I get the numbers on the saturations? Yes. If you go into, if you're inside the community, um, I did a 90 day video. I do 90 day videos every day. And today I did it and I literally covered all the numbers for you. So I would go look at that. If you're not in the community, once you get in, I'd go check it out. So all the numbers are in there. Um, can I ask a question? Yes, absolutely. Uh, yes. If what I want right now is just to learn how to do all uh, the videos and know how to do the, get this, um, the, uh, everything, what do I go with the super affiliate? You mean what product should you purchase? No, no, no. To start. I don't know nothing. I don't haven't done nothing. I need somebody to take me by the hand, like you will say. What do I have to buy? The super affiliate, and the, that one will teach me from A to C. Yes, yes, that that's will, the one that I have to buy. Yeah, that's that would equip you with every single thing that you need. Because, like, so for example, like the elite and the um, starter, they both do not have. Um, they only show you a few of the platforms. Like, you'll learn all the platforms with that product. Yes. And it's still like, it's so beginner friendly. It really is. I didn't even have a TikTok channel part of this. I went from, from scratch, complete beginner friendly. So yeah. And we, we walk you through that as well. Perfect. Thank you so much. Yes. Mm -hmm. Good question. Okay. Kimberly, you have a question? Hey. Um, yeah, I'm just, I'm in the community and how long do we have to promote this or is it over as of like Thursday or can people c continually join in? Well, yeah, our, our next live one is Thursday. So yeah, you can promote it today and tomorrow and Thursday. Mm -hmm. But after that though, it's it's over? Like we can't, so. Right, because I'm not okay. doing it again. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But they, okay, no, you I, know, I, they can still get access to it by being inside our community. Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. Yeah, no, I was just, I was seeing like, because I was like, well, if it's six months, it would be six months every time they would join. So, okay. This makes sense. Thanks. <laughs> oh no. Cause they'll get, they'll get access. And that's why, you know, it's important for anybody, you know, even when you start promoting this, it's like you guys listen, you know, the training starting next week that you'll get every week. Right. So they need to get purchasing now so they can be on those weekly calls. Mm -hmm. Does the Thursday one will be the same as uh, today? Yes. It'll be exactly the same today as I'm just going to go, um, I'm just going to go through the comments when you guys all jump off of here and just see what I need to add. And Alice was such a good help. Alice, I could just hug you. <laughs> um, she gave me some really good ideas that I, I dropped the ball on. So I'll be adding that, but it'll be, yeah, the exact same information, just whatever I, 
needed to add. Mm -hmm. Perfect, thank you. Yeah. Yes, okay. Any other questions? Anybody? Michelle, I, got, I got a question. Are you, you say you're gonna have a tech Zoom after yes. this? And, yeah, I've got a question. I'll, I've got a question I need to ask you when mm -hmm. I get over it. Okay, so sounds I'll, great. I'll yeah, thank you. Yeah, perfect. Sounds great. Yeah. All right. Well, thanks everybody for jumping on. I appreciate it. And again, get back with the person that introduced you to here and they can give you the premium link and let me know when you're inside the community. Okay. Make sure when you're introducing yourself, you let us know you were on this because I want to, I want to love on you and I'm excited because I'm going to get to know you really, really well over these next six months and help you make six figures in six months. So super excited. And that information will all be inside the community. So thanks everybody for getting on. Hi, Amy. I don't know if you can hear me. It's still recording. Oh, I just wanted to say hi. I've seen you on TikTok. <laughs>